ASU's Sun Devil Stadium in Tempe is packed with people and it's not even game day. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Mitch Carr. Rachel Cole has the night off. It is all for a religious movement called Awaken 2020 and one of the big draws tonight is none other than Kanye West. Team 12's Erica Stapleton is live outside the event in Tempe. Erica, what have people been saying? Not everyone came out here for Kanye today. We actually talked to people that got up at three in the morning to come out here just to get some good seats to the religious experience. Now, don't get me wrong. There are definitely some Kanye lovers in this crowd. We talked with people, though, coming from across the country, Kentucky, Florida, and a lot of native Arizonans who want to see more events like this in their communities. Kanye took the stage around four o'clock today, singing some of his newer beats while also hyping up the gospel choir. He has like a completely different vibe and he, yeah, he draws crowds in, you know, yeah. any, anything he does, people follow like me, including myself. It's crazy. Yeah. You know, goes from my minute to talking about Chick-fil-A being closed on Sunday, Jesus being a savior. It's just, wow. Um, we really liked it until, um, I can never say his name right. Well, when Kanye came on, we, you know, I believe his heart's in the right place, but a lot of people all of a sudden started piling in and they were more yell shouting Kanye and everybody was here really to come together and shout Jesus. You know, definitely a lot of mixed reactions out here, but everyone was for sure that there was a lot of energy in there today, and it is not over yet. Kanye has since left, but there's going to be more going on tonight. The whole event runs until about 10 o'clock after 12 hours of music. We'll have more stories tonight on 12 News at 10. For now, we're live in Tempe. Erica Stapleton, 12 News. Thank you, Erica. That is fantastic, and I am jealous.